Hip thrust. Place mid back on a bench or a platform that's about four inches off the floor. With feet shoulder width apart, feet can be slightly flared out or narrow stance, which is my personal favorite. Place all the weight on the heels and brace your core. Knees should not cave inward at all if you are intentionally using the glutes to direct the exercise. While keeping your core strong, think of keeping your torso straight throughout the whole movement. So even at the bottom part, it's like an extension in the glutes versus bending at the lower back. You should squeeze the glutes ever so slightly at the top, but try not to exaggerate the movement so you won't break form. Basically with the hip thrust is like maintaining spinal alignment throughout the whole movement. Uh, another thing, uh, you've probably heard it with the hip thrust, chin to chest. Do keep your chin, your head neutral to the spine, but relative to the movement.